Hello everybody, today we are taking a look at Artemis Rocket Build. The Artemis is an actual rocket that NASA has created and now it's in Minecraft. This is a review of the Minecraft DLC and I gotta say we're starting off strong because this DLC is the best price ever. Free baby, it costs zero dollars. Let's get into the map, we're starting off. What the heck are we in a, this is definitely the control room. We're about to launch this rocket. I don't even have to build anything. Okay, let's just hit the launch button and go. This instructor here is saying, we've made some special classes for you. I don't need to learn anything, okay? I don't read instructions. I just do the thing. Okay, well, it seems like they have a plan. We're gonna first send a satellite into space so that we can make our way to the moon. Uh, can't wait. Oh, look at, look at all these people. We got launch director, ground, support crew, safety officer. Can I talk to them? Oh, look. Oh, it explains what they do. The component engineer. He's way over here in the corner. Oh, I'm sorry, component engineer. It looks like your job isn't very important as you are so far away from everybody else. The imaginary integration lead is standing up there. You have an imaginary job. Pff, I want that type of job. Okay, let's go into training. Well, we're in some of the training room. Oh, is this an actual classroom? Wait a second. Did I, did I download a map just to join a classroom? Okay, we're gonna take this uh, lesson one, introduction to Artemis. Well, that was easy. I just clicked a few dialogue boxes and skipped right through that lesson. Which school was that easy? <laughs> now let's learn how rockets work. I hope that we don't have to spend long in class. Oh no, I think there's a test. Oh no. Do I have to figure this out? Oh no, there was no test. I, I, I thought that I had to choose either thrust or weight. They're just, there's a lot of words here, okay? And for dyslexic, honestly, this is too much. Okay, I've learned about velocity, delta V, weight, and thrust in lesson number two. Let's move on to lesson number three, propulsion and fuels. I, I just I just learned, I just learned something. I learned that the Artemis is solid rocket boosters instead of liquid uh, rocket fuel. I didn't know that. Okay, learned about engines, solid rocket boosters, uh, the stages of the rocket. Oh my gosh. Okay, I can see their names. Luckily, I see like you know one, two, three, four. I think this is the last, the last one. Which is honestly amazing. Okay, I hope that we could do something cool and not school related. Okay, and now I've learned about uh, some of the things coming up with the Artemis. Oh my gosh. Oh, is this is this uh? Is, uh are we having water cooler talk? Okay. Oh, hey, I'm a I'm a you know rocket engineer. Okay. Are we going in this elevator? Oh my gosh, we are. And time to punch the wall. <laughs> okay. Oh my gosh. What is going on here? We have left school and now we are in a rocket building facility. Holy cow. This is a big build. Okay. Let's find out what is going on here. Okay. Looks like we have an issue. We got to launch this satellite up into space. So if I, if I punch what is what what on earth a creeper wait what i don't want a creeper that's ridiculous no thank you i'm not exactly sure what i'm looking at here so as i go through these i see like a symbol of one two so that's now that's one three is this like art what artemis level i'm so confused and then we got oh whoa holy moly oh that's the f amount of fuel that we have okay and i need a budget of 50. So, what? Honestly, I don't understand this stuff yet. Here, maybe let's just hit test. I, I I don't know why. I got the budget to as low as possible, okay? I'm saving money for America. Let's test it. Even though the budget isn't quite... I don't... Uh, your rocket is too expensive. Dang it. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh, I finally got to cheaper parts. Oh, I didn't notice that there were cheaper options. Oh, okay. Okay. So it looks like I'm choosing the fairing up here. So I choose the fairing. I choose the body and I choose the rocket that is going to be used. So now I have a configuration where the, uh, honestly, the rocket engines are the most expensive part. Okay. But I guess that we're just firing off like one satellite so like it doesn't need that many engines okay let's test this and see if this works it's in budget oh my gosh we have data an ipad oh my gosh it's launching oh no oh it didn't have enough oh it looks like it didn't have enough something it, oh, oh no your rocket doesn't have enough thrust to lift the rocket and payload try increasing your rocket's thrust okay 
Well, uh, if I go through all of these, oh, that one's exactly on budget. That's only, is it, what was that before? Oh, it was this. So it looks like it's using like two pixels. And then this uses three pixels. Okay, let's test it. The suspense. <gasps> oh my gosh, it worked. Okay, so it was like a little puzzle. I needed to get the exact budget, the exact thrust, the exact weight, and I needed to be perfect. Okay, so we now have a really fancy like upper stage situation. Oh, I switched into creative mode. Oh, that's interesting. Inside of here, I'm in creative mode. I think I'm getting to design the upper stage. So uh, let me just double check. I, I think that this is gonna like make the look of the rocket look like mine. Okay, I'm done with my rocket build. I was trying to make a cat here, but honestly it just kind of, it looks like a surprised cow. Uh, okay, I, I couldn't do it. But I also added some wings to kind of make it my own on the side. And then I went for like a white and orange color scheme at the top, which seemed very NASA-esque. So let's lock this in as my design. And what are we gonna move on to next? Are we gonna do the booster now? Oh no, no we're not. Oh my gosh, it's constructing in front of my eyes. Oh, oh my gosh, that's mine. That's my, <laughs> my upper stage that I designed. Okay, well that's cool. Change to green. Change to, wait, what is going on here? Wait, decrease brush size, small, wait. I have a paintbrush? I'm so confused. Now it's time to paint my rocket. Oh, okay. Let's go with red and then I'll change the breast size to large. Oh, 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 I can stand way back here and just paint all of it. Ah, I see, I see. Well, let's just go for a red look. I assume that won't mess up my uh, upper stage that I did over there. Oh, it will mess up my upper stage. Oh no, you gotta watch out, watch out. Don't mess up your upper stage. Okay, uh, let's paint the rest of this little bad boy. As I'm gonna put, I'm gonna spray paint the bottom black. I'm not sure why I care, but I care. Okay, I'm all done with that. Are we gonna launch my rocket? into space. I guess so. We're doing a satellite. That was the whole point of the whole situation. Okay, let's launch this baby into space. Oh my gosh. Oh, the weather is a go. Oh, that's good. So is this Artemis 1 that we're, we're launching here? Oh my gosh, the sun is going, well, sorry, delayed launch, delayed launch. For those who don't know, by the way, I tried to go see the Artemis uh, the first time it was, it was supposed to launch, but um, delays meant that I was not able, oh my gosh, this is this is crazy. Okay, we're still in the cutscene. Uh, delays meant that I was unable to watch it go off. I was excited, I was, I was good to see it. Oh my gosh, the rocket is going off. The one that I made, the one that I crafted, the one, wow, look at that paint job. So sweet. That is a good looking paint job. And there it goes, up into space. I guess, are we gonna see the satellite? What type of satellite is this? Communication satellite? Okay, we did it. Nothing exploded. We didn't have a rapid disassembly in space, which is fantastic. So now we are going to be sending supplies to the moon. And as you can see, I have a much higher budget to accomplish my goals. So I, now I need to figure out the puzzle of what is the perfect ratio of, uh, you know, all these different type of cargo things. <laughs> I don't understand this creeper one. Doesn't seem like this one fits. I'm one, one emerald off. Oh my gosh. <gasps> no, dang it, 150. Oh, 160. Oh my gosh, I think I figured it out. Remember that this is an education edition map. So it really is more focused on learning and less focused on having a fun, crazy, a good time. Oh my gosh, it worked. I did it. Okay, so now we have a, <laughs> a uh, su successful supply mission to the moon. That was our test, I guess. That was our, that we were, we were testing out the theories that it would work. Here's the real question. Do we get to go to the moon? Do I get to go to the moon? Or am I just a earth-based engineer? I'm not gonna do any of the uh, customization that I can do. I can add whatever blocks I want, uh, which is kind of cool here. Let me just uh, quickly, I'll just add, <laughs> just to show that, like I did something. We're gonna add some arms. <laughs> he's gonna have, he's gonna look, oh my gosh, I need to make him look like a snowman. Okay, 
We got <laughs> our snowman rocket. Oh my gosh, this is so messed up. Oh, his arms got cut off. Oh, apparently I built outside of the uh, the thing and his arms don't exist anymore. Okay, well that's fine. I think I'm gonna skip the paint job on this one. Back in the launch center. Uh, this is, I guess this is Kennedy's Space Center. Uh, where is this? What, I wonder, this must be modeled off of a real building. And I probably, they probably told me and I missed it. What happens if the weather's bad? What if we get here and the forecast ain't good? We gotta delay the flight. Do we have more rockets on the bottom of this? Oh my, we do. Oh, I didn't think about that because our actual, there's, yeah, there he goes. Our snowman into space. I guess we have a lot more rockets. The last one only had two. Now this one has six. Holy moly, that's a lot of rocket engines. Well, now it is time to send humans to the moon. And I think this is where we are gonna pause it. Although they did mention that there's like a lot of differences, okay, with humans than the cargo that we have been sending. So I'm wondering if there's even more steps to this. But as you can see, what a crazy map and completely free. So I can't help but recommend it if uh, you wanna play around making rockets. This is a really good free alternative and maybe you'll learn something in the process as well. That about wraps it up for me. Like I said, free in the Minecraft marketplace. So uh, can't beat that price. I hope you enjoyed the video if you did leave a like leave a comment and make sure you subscribe for future videos and i'll see you in the next one bye